Welcome back. I'm so excited for this one. Yeah. 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 Welcome back to my channel. I am Rachel. Today is the first day of the semester and I'm so excited for this semester. This is a list of the courses that I'll be taking and today I have just two classes, Constitutional Law and Psychology. Let's get ready for school. Bring my foamy muse. Apply my daily moisturizer. It's like a thick creamy texture but it comes out really nice on the skin next is my dr rachel sunscreen and i just apply this amount can you see i don't know if you can see the glue the first day of school for me not for her i started last week <laughs> oh yeah Number. I got back from school some minutes ago. I how first semester I hated constitutional law so much, but now I just see myself really enjoying the class. And then my second class, psychology, was a new lecturer, so at first it was sort of boring, but later on it got interesting, just that the lecturer took like extra 20 or 30 minutes, so it was a really long class. It was a really productive day. I don't know. I'm just excited for tomorrow, even though I'm like so tired, and it was so hard to get myself to wake up this morning, but hopefully tomorrow will be better i have three classes tomorrow i have a presentation tomorrow and i don't know how that's going to go but hopefully it goes well you all my new subscribers you guys are literally the best very quickly before i head out i want to talk to you guys about something which is this product this kiss beauty lip oil that is such a game changer i got this in the orange and can you see that natural shimmer and glow on my lips like I want to talk to you guys about something that happened last week friday so my gas finished i went to fill it up next to the place where i was filling the gas it was like a divided you know business owned by one person so the sales girl i asked her how much for a particular product i wanted to buy and she was like oh it cost three thousand seven hundred i was like okay i'll come back later on to get it so later on i came to get the product the girl wasn't around and there was someone else there another salesperson so i come in and asked the guy okay this is the product that i want you know get it for me and i felt the urge to tell him oh i already asked the person selling this and she told me it's this amount so can you just go and get it for me but i don't know i just said to hush and just you know tell the boys to get the products i didn't discuss anything price related i just told him to get it so he gets it remember the girl told me it's three thousand seven hundred this guy goes oh it's four thousand first of all he checks the price list and then he says it's four thousand and i'm like i already came here in the morning i told the girl i wanted this product and she said it's three thousand seven so why tell me it's four thousand at that moment he knew that he was lying and he knew i already caught him and he started laughing so before i actually told the guy that the 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 price was three seven i heard this voice in my head telling me that i should tell the guy that the price is three thousand five hundred you know that way i get to you know bargain a bit without bargaining a bit just something very odd when i rebuked that voice and i was like why would i be lying if this guy can be lying to me and me i'm lying to him then what makes me different from him then tomorrow i'll come out and be like oh i'm a christian like what makes me different from this guy if he's lying i'm lying like what's the difference and i thank god that i did not stupidly lie and say oh it's three five and then i will gain extra money like so after that event happened i went to church and it was the same exact thing that was preached but in a different way so you know the preacher was like now that we are in christ we should come to the knowledge and the realization of the fact sorry my battery is blue that now that we are christians we should come to the realization of the fact that we have a new master we have a new government and she gave an example about when she was working her previous place her boss would give her instructions and she has quit and she's working in a different place now so 
her former boss can't come and tell her to get up and go somewhere and she just get up and start going because now she has a new boss she has a new master and even the bible says that you can't serve two masters at the time you either hate one and like the other so pick for yourself this very day which master you would serve that is the same way that now you've come to um christianity you've come to christ you're a believer you don't have any business with those things you used to do back then so if you used to steal you don't have any business with stealing anymore if you used to fornicate you don't have any business with fornicating anymore you have a new master that has a new template has you know directions guides terms conditions on how you should serve him so why then are you still running you know your life by the template of your former master it's either you don't know what you've gotten into or you know and you just choose to ignore so i'm here to tell you today that you have a new template and the things you do before cannot control your life anymore come to the facts and the terms that you have a new master and even as i'm saying this thing i'm saying it for myself because i know there are some parts of my life that i need to correct and i need to work on so this message is for all of us if you've been watching to this part thank you so much i will see you in my next video i hope this meets you well it should meet you well until next time goodbye oh by the way like and subscribe bye